Dear Diary, May 15th. Remember when bad things happen in our lives like illness or accident or anything, God can always change it to be a huge blessing in our lives, but God sees me as a skid stain in John's shorts because he doesn't wear underwear. Please help us. I deserve to be represented. It's constitutional, though I live illegally in a cubby shed. It's like a real shed, but made out of scraps. Please, I need two attorneys along with my attorney here in Levy County. In my head, I am innocent of all allegations and not in jail yet. Though I feel my time is coming soon, somehow I always manage to step in deeper shit every time. I am living proof of reincarnation. I was once a poop of Daniel Lambert. He was celebrated as the fattest man on record. In 1805, he made a tour of England drawing large crowds and also received paying visitors to his lodgings. He was said to have weighed 728 pounds slash 330 kilograms at the time of his death in 1809. Then in 1874, I was reincarnated as Mary Ann Bevan, an English nurse who, after developing acromegaly, toured the circus sideshow circuit as the ugliest woman in the world. I later died in 1933. Again, in 1962, I was then reincarnated as the woman I am today. I've seen the world and experienced many things, such as being a pole dancing stripper, who then becomes a stalker, who then later owns a turtle purgatory in Otter Creek, Florida. I've seen the world and been many things. I feel each time I've been reincarnated, I've carried over traits from my previous lives.